Hello, 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 everybody, and welcome back to Mechanical Mastery. Um, so, as I said, I'd do off camera, I did some tidying, and look at the space that we've got. So much room for activities here. Um, so, yeah, basically, I took what was like our huge um, basic mechanical essence thing, which was here. I removed the pulverizers because. I think we're making enough EMC now that I don't need to necessarily worry about that extra step and I couldn't think of any way where I could sort everything out with the extra dust produced. So now we just have it all smelting up. Uh, I had to upgrade these to tier 3 to be able to keep up with everything. I have sped up some of it, not all of it, um, but these for example, I even went as far as making the resonant. Uh, integral components because I needed the speed to basically keep up with this whole production um, and now this is all kind of nice and quick I did also decide to add buffers to everything so instead of for example storing one stack of gears here one stack of gears here now we have no none here until this of course back stuffs uh, and we have a stack here but we have nine stacks and three so these buffers make it so that actually, if we ever do have a pickup in um, production or usage, it kind of all flows through a little bit nicer rather than immediately bottlenecking. Um, then over here, this is pretty much the same setup. I did have to chuck in another EMC link with iron just to kind of keep everything up to speed because I did reinstall all the speed upgrades in. Uh, and again, bottle, uh, we, we gave a little bit of a, a buffer here. And I just decided because we're making enough steel, we could have a storage drawer with a stack of blocks in um, because I'm sure it's useful to have access to. Um, and then over here was where it became a little bit fun. We kind of just, I flipped these up on their heads basically. And now we've got our Invar and our bronze being produced individually in these like little three by three setups. So furnace, induction smelter, furnace, outputting into the press. So it's quite nice. And again, these both have um, plenty. I mean, this one's literally backed up to 32 stacks of bronze rods. And this one I think is slowly climbing up, which is nice. Um, I then sped up our mechanical mixer so that it was producing a little bit faster because I found that once I had sped this boy up, um, we actually weren't keeping up with the amount of uh, regular mechanical essence. And now, as you can see, we've actually got over just about a stack in there. And then we've got a stack limiter here, so we've got a stack in here and a stack in here. So we've got about three stacks in total. Um, and that was kind of the main tidying. I don't think we moved anything else. I did, of course, hook these up um, because we realized at the end of the next episode, uh, end of the last episode, we're going to need those. Um, we can have a quick look at how our crystals are doing. We, oh Christ, we have 46 stacks of charged and 138 stacks of regular. I think we're pretty good. This system has just been running in the background while I've kind of racked my brain about how to reorganize all of this. I then um, redid this so that we had our basic infusers and our enrichers sort of all set up again, just so it was a little bit nicer. And I removed our storage wall from here because it kind of felt a bit redundant because I kept coming down here anyway to kind of grab everything. So now this is all down here nice and tidy. And I don't think I did anything else. I did actually um, set this up just so it could be easily uh, run because I ended up needing to adjust some bits anyway. Oh, this is not a true platform, is it? Uh, there we go. So yeah, I think we, we got some nice stuff done in the break. I also went out of my way and crafted a Klein Star Sphere, which recipes for that are you need four Klein Star Veers, and for each Klein Star Veer you need four Klein Star Dries, for each one of those you need four Klein Star Zvies, for each one of those, you need four Kleinstar Eins, and then for each one of those, you need to do this. So it was just a very laborious crafting, um, just constantly craft four of these, craft four of these, craft four of these, next, craft four, and then it was, I just thought, there's no point because you want to see that on camera, but I did it because I think, now that we've had the chickens for a bit and I've got some feathers, we can make this uh, Swift Wolf Ring. So we're going to need some iron, some lava, 
and um, oh, we don't need that much. Uh, some iron, some lava, and four of you. Uh, lava, do we have a bucket? We do. And I think we should now be able to fly, which would be quite fun um, if I'm correct in what I'm doing. Uh, so then we want to make the ring. And then creative flight. And what that'll do is that'll basically slowly use my stored EMC from here. So slow that we probably won't even notice it. Um, and I think I can just put that in a ring slot and now perfect. We don't have to worry about the void and we can kind of whiz around it. Oh my god, that's the underside of my base is so ugly. Oh my god, what is this whole thing for? What is that for? Oh, uh, yeah, I know what that's for. That's the, that's the, uh, the gunpowder room. Um, yeah, this is great. Ooh. I don't know what keeps going dudung in my ear. This keeps happening. It's very confusing. Um, but this feels great. To be able to fly and see everything running, it's wonderful. Do we take full damage? No, we don't. Even better. Perfect. So now we can mark that off the list. I did also think about making a whole um, dark matter set just for the sake of flexing. So we can take a stack of dark matter and it didn't even dent our system, which is a little bit nuts. Um, lovely. So we can now equip that. I just thought, well, oh my god, we look terrifying. Dun, 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 dun. Um, so we can take these off of our list as well. And then a couple diamonds. We had some in here, didn't we? Love that. Uh, we can just make a couple of you to make one of you and to make one of you. Just so we can... Um, I don't know, it's literally flexing, isn't it? There's there's no reason to have it. Um, we're even, for the, for the point of flexing, we're just going to throw these off the edge. I don't need them anymore, because now we have these ones, which is lovely. Perfect. Um, and I can now put these away, which didn't really do a huge amount to our EMC, but we are now good. Oh, one thing I did do, I upgraded this boy from a, uh, I think it was the advanced, to the elite, and then to the ultimate. Because um, we were having some power problems where I, I realized again, this couldn't input or output enough for us. Um, with all of the machines we have running now, um, it just wasn't able to output enough. I think it was capped at like 6,400. So we probably could have kept it at the elite, but I thought may as well just take it all the way to the ultimate um, because these also, which I think I did this on camera. I built a second um, gas burner just to be able to cope with some of the power demand every so often. And they actually weren't able to input into the cube fast enough. Um, they were like capped at like 6,400. But I think now they can put out between them like 50,000 each, which is great. Um, so yeah, we've made a little bit of progress now on camera and I've not just spent the entire time recapping what I've done off camera, which always feels a little bad sometimes. It feels like I do spend a lot of time off camera doing stuff, but um, there's not much more I can say really. I There's, there's stuff that will just be boring um, if you are watching it. Uh, you will just be like, why do I care about this? Uh, we need silicon. Oh, that's that's easy. We can definitely do silicon, no problem. We need uh, certus quartz, no problem. We need diamond, no problem, and we need gold. So one diamond, one gold, one gold. Uh, then can we make a? Um, Dark matter furnace is a thing, isn't it? Just needs blocks of dark matter. Um, I think they're very quick at smelting. Uh, oh, is a block just four? Uh, it is lovely. If I could just do this properly, there we go. Uh, and then for the sake of doing a little on-camera cookery, um, let's just do this and then do this and this. Lovely. And we can, for now, put you guys here. Um, do we have coal anywhere? 
Oh, uh, we do have some down here, don't we? Right? Yeah. That'll do. Uh, we put one stack of you in here. Oh, actually, you know what we could use? Um, if we're really smart about this. Uh, put you away. Oh, damn it. Uh, one, two, three, four. One. One. There we go. Um, if we're really smart about this, what we could do is we could actually uh, chuck you away for a second and get, like, two stacks of that, which is better fuel. And then we can come over here. And because we're going to need a lot of silicon, I'm sure, we have so much quartz. It's unbelievable. We'll grab 512, because why not? And one, two, three. Uh, one, two, three, four, and four. Perfect. What's happening here? All right. I'll allow it. I don't fully know why it's going on both sides, but as long as it's working. Um, so then I believe it's you place this here with this. Uh, then this here with this. Then we need one of you. And we place this here with this. And then we need one silicone. What's happening? Are these outputting down some for some reason? I think that's what's happening, isn't it? They're outputting below. Weird. Um, couldn't tell you why. Put that there. Oh, has that got all 60? Yeah, it does. Wait. Um, can I? Yeah, there we go. Uh, and then each of these, I think only just needs to be hammered. Kaplunk. Uh, oh, is this a repeat process thing? Ten times. Oof. Okay, so actually, we can take the, I think it's the silicon press that needs silicon, right? Yeah, okay. Inscribe uh, press, inscribe. Wait. Oh, certus, oh, here you go. Uh, deploy certus quartz, deploy gold, deploy diamond, deploy silicon. Sure. Silicon. Uh, so this needs another nine. And then here, oh, we didn't realize this was a, a 10 times thing. I thought this was one time. That's my bad. Well, let me maybe do this manually off camera and then we'll come right back. Okay, that took a heavy amount of time, but I have taken them all to 19 so that on camera, we can have a good old time and watch them become exactly what we need. Bam! One done. Sorry, was that all we needed to... What? Why have we completed one here? Oh, we completed this. Oh, we only needed one. And it's going to give us one. <laughs> uh, we're making all of them. So we're going to leave that for now. Because, I don't know. We don't need, uh, don't need any more of them. Uh, maybe we'll find one that we want more than one of, but for now that is a redundancy. And what have we done here? Oh, Mobius fuel, um, all of this, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so it wants us to do these bits next as well. Uh, but that is our last press being pressed. Bang. All done. Um, which is great. So now, uh, amethyst automation or ME start again. Realistically, we just want to start doing it, right? Um, I couldn't see why we wouldn't. Uh, let's just, just for the sake of it, it doesn't really matter, does it? Uh, probably not a silicon press. Let's just get another engineering press, sure. Um, right. So, what does it want us to do? Let's get a. Let's mute this sound, maybe. 
muffle, uh, one set anchor, uh, recent. Why is it never here on recent? It's create. Create. Um, what's this called again? Um, mixer. Maybe just mixer. Neither of those worked. Um, create. Uh, cogs? I don't know what this sound is, is the problem. Um, whistle wrench. Doesn't look like there's anything for this. Mixing. Oh, that's better. And then I think all we want is then cogs after that, don't we? Uh, cogs. Do you know what's better? It's not constantly because this is now set to hold 16 of each item. Um, so like it's never stopping it's never going to stop processing because they all use themselves pretty fast um anyway um that was just driving me a little bit insane so wants us to make a controller so we can take these off now uh we can take silicon off i know how to do that um we can take charge certus and regular certus off and i think we can take these two off as well and i can take that off which clears our thing much better. So now we want to make an ME drive as well. We want to make a, probably a crafting terminal is the main one we want to do, which is going to need an ME terminal. Oh, with a whole thing, that's fine. That's a crafting line that we'll need to look at. Um, and then we're probably going to want to make some 4K drives um, and then inscribers. Um, do we have lazier AE? Advanced inscribers, we do. I possibly want to just straight away move to making advanced inscribers when we can. But this is the first thing we need to make, basically. Um, so we're going to need a fair few pistons. So we need, what, eight pistons um, and some slime. Which I know we've made slime before. I think it was these two, right? This plus this slime ball. Perfect. That is good for me. So then we're going to want some wood. We're going to need some cobble. We're going to need some redstone and some iron. Uh, oh, wait, no, 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 no. Uh, iron. I did eventually take out the um, the 1x64 upgrades for a lot of these, besides like zinc, because I thought now that EMC production's back up and running and we're looking good again, I could probably do with making sure that we don't just have a small amount of everything and we could do with a fair bit more. Uh, we also needed copper, didn't we? That's a good point. We should just grab it while we're here. Probably grab another one of you. Lovely. Right, let's do this thing. So, inscribers. We need to make eight of you. Um, is making 16 going to be a problem? Do we need two for you? No, we just need one. So, let's just make eight for now. Let's not, let's not push the boat out. Uh, and then we need to cover all of you with slime. Then we need to make four of you. Yeah, that's fine. That makes sense. Yeah. Um, and we could do with finding an AE place. Eek. Um, maybe over here. Just trying to think one second. Um, I'm thinking over here. For now. <laughs> I don't know. Um... Do these take regular universal cables? Yeah, they do. Lovely. And then a flux point will go right here. And this will connect to power, which should mean these all have a little bit of power. And now we can take our silicon and just chuck you in here. And the reason we want the advanced one is we can only put one in at a time, which is just dire. Oh no, see, looking at the top, okay. Uh, that and that for now, which is good. Uh, so we're gonna make need to make a lot of the silicon presses. Uh, I think we can hop it in. 
uh, if I'm not mistaken. Do we have any spare chests? Plenty. Uh, and we're going to need to make a fair few hoppers anyway, so let's not get mad at making a fair few. Uh, we have plenty of iron anyway. 20 hoppers, that'll do. Uh, if I put you here, put you like that, will you hopper in? Ah, you'll hopper in from the side. Okay, that's fine. I don't need to hopper in the other ones for now um, because this is just the main one that we want to make plenty of printed circuits. Um, so now we've made the inscribers, let's maybe look at just converting these straight away. So what do we need? We need the diamond which goes into the engineering press. Got it. Uh, where do we put the engineering press? Ah, oh, perfect. On the side, which actually means we can probably hopper into you. I think we need to make one more um, one more of these boys. Um, yeah, because we want one to craft everything in. So let's come up here real quick and make one more. Uh, oh, we ran out of iron. Oh, that's because oh, well, I don't really care about collecting it right now. Let's just do that. Uh, and then bing, bang, bong, bong. Uh, one, two, clear you, and then do that, and then do that. Lovely. Because we're going to need one to do the actual crafting in. Um, so we'll do this, and we'll do this. Actually, that's a valid point. Where did all that iron go? I don't know. Um, but that's fine. Uh, so then we have... So how many will we need? We'll need, if we're making five of them, we'll need ten engineering. So we will need, yeah, just ten. Okay. Uh, so there's ten of you. There's eighteen of you. So then I should be able to do bing, bang, bong. Uh, and you're already hooked up. And that will make our thing. If we just organize this in our inventory, we should pretty much be able to do that. And then we'll make 10 of you. What else do we need? We've got the hoppers. We should have the iron on us. Yeah, so pretty much just whiz through, make 10 of these, and then we can convert all of these to the more easier and automatable ones. Um, and they hold like a stack of items rather than one at a time, which is much more pleasant than what we're doing now, basically, which is a very menial way of doing this. What other things are in um, Lazier A? Uh, circuit etcher, what is that used for? Oh, for making new versions of presses, okay. Um, making something crazy. Oh, for just straight making, um, processes instead of needing this whole system. That might be quite a nice thing to look into getting. Um, pulse grinders? Oh, okay, yeah, just basically grinding most things. That's fine. Uh, matter infusers. Oh, okay, so actually most of these are quite useful. Um, what does this one do? Emmy requester. Keeps track of up to six different item types. Oh, okay, we don't need that, that's fine. And then the flux aggregator. Uh, oh, okay, kind of useful, I think. Not sure. Um, but that's fine. So for now, at least we'll upgrade these, uh, the bare minimum we can do sort of thing. Um, and then we should probably make some acceleration cards. Um, acceleration cards. There we go. Yeah. Which, Ooh, is that, oh, that's an energy card. Uh, we want acceleration cards, which use an advanced card, which is fine. We these are these are not too expensive for us, uh, and then Fluix crystals. That's fine. Um, that shouldn't be too bad, and that'll help us speed up some of these processes. So for now, what I'll do is I'll finish making these and upgrading these off camera, and then we'll come back in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will see you guys then. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay. Um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video. I don't know which side I'm on. 
these ones, or this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything. Go. Go wild. <laughs>